My name is Gergely Madras. I'm originally from Budapest, from Hungary. I spent uh, my first 20 years in Hungary. Then I moved to Vienna, where I studied conducting. I lived there for five years. Then I moved to England, to Manchester. And now I uh, recently received a new job in London with the English National Opera. So I'm moving there in two days. I'm Christian Mason and I'm a composer. I, in fact, come from London and I lived there most of my life, though I studied at the University of York. In the last four years, I came back to London, where I've been doing a PhD, and I'm handing it in in a few weeks. My name is Benjamin Atayir. I'm from south of France, uh, Toulouse. Uh, I am a composer. I'm half French, half Lebanese, and uh, I'm living in Paris for my studies. My name is uh, Daniel Cohen. I come from Israel, from Tel Aviv. I'm a conductor. I conduct a lot of, in Israel at the Opera House with the, the Philharmonic uh, once in a while, um, in Europe with some orchestras and making a living. <laughs> <laughs> Daniel, I think yes. it's not, uh, you, you don't have to rehearse this. Sure. You want to take it out? Yes. Yeah. The rubber ball doesn't really function. Can you show him what you meant? This is Christian, the composer. Hi. Nice to meet you. Yeah, for the Super Bowl. We were four composers and Pulas chose two. We had this meeting where we were introduced and this arranged marriage of, of two couples took place. Conductor and uh, composer. And they told us that we are going to work together for the next two years. So, yeah, uh, Pulas matchmaking. Yes. Gage and I both were based in England, so it was a natural partnership. Did they, did they, do you think they thought of that? We are both Mediterranean uh, people. Same, same so. Yes. <laughs> Could I also ask, the trumpets actually can always be more. More, trumpets more. Not, not here, please here. Ah. Yum, pom, 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 but not staccato. We need to have two peaks in the double basses. Can we just see this bar? Fortissimo piano. Yeah. You can change tempo within a bracket if you want. Yes, so try to be adventurous. Sometimes much faster, sometimes much slower. What is very unusual about this is the way to the final performance, which is extraordinarily different and very rich. In real life, we have very few time to make corrections. Maybe you have two or three hours rehearsal if you're quite lucky, and then you have the concert. Here we can put many ideas and try them, and try out if that's uh, convincing or if that make me make me happy. When you have the 316, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, that is the, the, the Sache, and man must that learn. Yeah, only one thing, prepare better the succession of, of, of the question that you have not to look at the paper and so on. You must do, do the chapter in your, in your head. For me, that so, is very, very nötig. And also, when man nicht, nicht den Mut hat, wirklich the uh, Zeitgenössische Musik vorwärts zu, zu, zu treiben, then also, that we nie, uh, wir, wir sind in a eine, eine culture die stirbt. I I think it's it's pretty nice if we we talk about uh, gesture, uh, you know, yeah. uh, like here. Really, we got all these wonderful, wonderful opportunities. But also, it's about creating a new way of collaboration between the composer and the conductor. That is not uh, first the composer finishes his job and then the conductor takes over and produces the piece. We can share things. We can share ideas. And I had a chance to emerge into uh, Christian's music. 
and if the conductor is next to me and around, that's the most ideal situation. I feel that I've been a part of the process of creating it and that's a very different feeling when you are standing in front of the orchestra with material that you kind of know since it started developing. That piece becomes very special to you, you know. Thank you for your help. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you. And uh, we meet at the new meet soon.